Okay, here's another quick uh, sorting video. I'm saying speed sorting, but when the camera's on, I don't know that I'm going as fast as I normally would. But, uh, you know, I showed you how I sorted in alphabetical order. Uh, I got all the A's, B's, C's, got the B's. Then I did the B.O.'s, pulled out the Barry Bonds. These are just Barry Bonds. And so in order to figure out, to organize those, or any, this is just a way that I sort my players, but you could sort a set like this. So it's uh, 10s, 20s, 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s, 70s, don't have any 80s yet, 90s, 100s, 200s, 300s and above, uh, single digit. What, what would go there would be alphanumeric or no number stuff. So here's 12, these uh, McDonald's, a bunch of those. Like I said, I didn't knowingly buy these, but uh, they came in a big lot and then you put them so. Uh, 52, 45, 49, PP1. I don't care about the prefix. I just go by the number. Uh, 154, HR6, SS5. These are X7s. 25, 2, T2s. Again, just look at the number and put it in the pile. I don't have to look. Uh, pretty much don't have to look. Uh, also, Put in the 80s. Thank sponsors. You, I know them by heart. <laughs> Maybe you do too if you're following the podcast. They're, they're loyal and I want to be loyal to, to mention them. So a lot of these are tops cards. Uh, not too many Paninis, not too many upper decks, but uh, mostly tops, but still. Okay, power decks. I don't go to the trouble to find the number on that. I just put it in the, you know, it's kind of a miscellaneous, even though it's not. Strictly speaking, alphanumeric. So, um, you know, and some of these are kind of just different things. Again, if I don't see the number, I'm gonna stick it in that uh, alphanumeric pile that's right there. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, the same thing you see on your, on your, uh, on your iPhone. But again, that's the 10s, the 20s, the 30s. The two doesn't go there, the 20s go there. Okay, if I were getting it down to the last uh, digit sort, I could do it. Uh, by that, but that's uh, usually it's pretty easy once you get it to these uh, these piles. You can kind of see where the duplicates are, and uh, frankly, there's a few better cards in here, but uh, you know a bunch of not so great. In fact, a bunch of you know junk wax. But here's an OPG. Uh, OPG is better than tops in those years. And see, I just knocked over uh, 39. Gosh. It's better to do it on a table that's not very slick. I'm doing this so I can have, I don't know if it's good lighting or bad lighting, but it's just where, uh, this is back in the back where I do stuff. So 25 and come to the end. And again, it depends. Uh, frankly, like I said, it's easier to sort when you get up to critical mass because if you, it's, uh, you know, you don't want to go to the trouble to sort 20 cards uh, you ought to be able to just kind of see what you got. Uh, but once you get to a hundred or a couple hundred, then it's probably worth uh, seeing. So, you yeah, know, just try to go. Uh, my eyes are just not as good. So you've got to train yourself to just look at the, at the digit. Those were 8AG, but that's just 8 for me for this. And so then I could sort the the one to nines into one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And I, I would do that, but it's not a big deal. But again, the every time I do a miracle, numerical sort, I'm going to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, whether that's tens, twenties, thirties, forties, fifties, sixties, seventies, eighties, nineties. I'm going to do it every time that way. Just like I could do the 300s, I could do in the 300, 310s, 320s, 330s, 340s, 350s, 360s, 370s, 380s, 390s. I could, but I won't need to. So uh, this is just Barry Bonds. Again, it's pretty overwhelming when you figure out this is Barry Bonds. He's one of many players. Not my favorite, but I just happen to have a, a bunch of them laying around. Again, when I go through the dollar boxes, uh, some of these are, are from a, a group that I bought. Uh, you know, when I buy the whole box and some of them are uh, when I pick out cards. Uh, so still having fun with it. If you, like I said, if you like sorting, then you're on your way to being, uh, uh, having a lot of fun collecting because there's a lot of opportunity for sorting if you're doing, um, <laughs> if 
you buy very many cards. So thanks, everybody. Back again tomorrow with another uh, probably audio episode. But this is just to give you a chance on the YouTube channel to see uh, what I said when I was talking about speed sorting. So this is numerical sort. I do it this way every single time, and that's the secret. Thanks.